In this question, let us try to integrate cosecant x dx. So this function has an interesting way in which you can integrate. So I'll say a process in which you can integrate cosecant x. Using the same process, you can also integrate secant x. So the technique is I'll multiply cosecant x with cosecant x plus cortex in the numerator and denominator. I'll multiply the function with cosecant x plus cortex in the numerator and denominator. So now what is the simplification that we get when I do this? So now if cosecant x plus cot x is equal to t. So if I say cosecant x plus cot x is equal to t. So if I differentiate this cosecant x integration is minus of cosecant x cot x and cot x is integration is minus cosecant square x dx is equal to dt. So if I take a minus as common minus cosecant x as common. So you get cosecant x plus cot x and dx is equal to dt. So cosecant x times cosecant x plus cot x dx, this will be the numerator will become minus dt. So this integration becomes integration of minus dt by t that is equal to minus ln mod t plus c. That is equal to minus ln of mod of cosecant x plus cot x plus c is the integration of cosecant x. So you can further simplify this if you want. So this cosecant x plus cot x can be written as cosecant x plus cot x can be written as 1 plus cos x by sin x, right? 1 plus cos x by sin x that is equal to so 1 plus cos x can be written as 2 cos square x by 2 by 2 sin x by 2 cos x by 2. So this 2 and 2 gets cancelled, cos and cos gets cancelled. This can be written as cot of x by 2. Cot of x by 2. So this integration can also be written as minus ln of mod cot x by 2 plus c. And if this minus goes inside, becomes power minus 1 that is the reciprocal. So this becomes log mod tan x by 2 plus c. So integration of cosecant x can be written as minus log of mod of cosecant x plus cot x or this can also be written as log mod tan x by 2 plus c plus c or directly if you take this power minus 1 take this minus 1 inside log it becomes power minus 1 so 1 by cosecant x plus cot x is cosecant x minus cot x so this can also be written as directly log of cosecant x minus cot x plus c so all these three are formulas for integration of cosecant x dx so in a similar fashion you can also integrate secant x. You just need to multiply and divide with secant x plus tan x. So that gives you the same process.